So welcome to your 20th Visual Basic tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you how to use the do while loop. So as with the previous tutorial this is a loop and in the next tutorial I'm going to be teaching you how to use another loop. So these three tutorials are all about loops. So anyway we're doing the do while loop this time. So just put a button in and resizes. Change the text of the button to start again and the form uh, the form text is going to be do while and this program is going to do the same as what the previous one did uh, well pretty much the same just a uh, small difference so first we're just going to declare a variable again so I just do dim and I'm going to use my num again as integer and says equal to zero and then I make some space underneath that then here we put do while oops while and then my num equal uh, is less than five and then it should put loop there and I as with the previous tutorial I'll explain all this code after I've actually written it out then here just put message box dot show and inside here we're just gonna put my num colon with a space at the end and then the and sign my num so that's all the code we need to do now and what this is basically going to do is declaring the variable as an integer and it's going to be equal to one and then do while so that's just stating that we're using a do while loop and then my num is less than five so do this code after my num, uh, when my num is less than five, so this can be any kind of condition that you want. And then here we're just going to put a message box, and then loop is just saying once you finish that, go back and go back to do while. And there's one more thing I've got to put underneath message box that show. We're just going to do my num equals my num plus one. So basically, we're just going to set it to my num to what it is at the moment plus one. So it's just going to add one to it. So again, this is doing exactly what we did in the previous tutorial, basically. So I click on the button. My num is zero. One, two, three, four. And you see, it didn't go on five because five isn't less than five. It's equal to five. If we set this as equal five, then it would be um it would work it would like show up when it's five but less than five is one two uh, zero one two three four so that's how to use the do while loop inside of visual basic don't forget to comment rate and subscribe if you found this useful and i'll see you in the next tutorial